If you spend countless hours on Excel, Google spreadsheets, writing formulas, interacting with databases, this AI tool is honestly going to blow your mind. Hi everyone, I'm Ishan Sharma and in today's showcase of an amazing AI tool, we are having a look at Quadratic HQ. Quadratic is an AI spreadsheet which helps you to interact and chat with your data with natural language and get insights, create visualizations and do a lot more by just natural language. So this is QuadraticHQ.com AI spreadsheet with code and connections. It helps you create analysis, you can create charts, you can build models, you can create reports, you can view dashboards dashboards, you can do all of this by just writing simple prompts, create a dashboard analyzing our website visitor metrics, and it does that for you in seconds. It is insane how useful this tool is. You get to insights faster than ever before without you having to write queries yourself by just typing out what you want. As you can see, it's just plain English. Now, let me show you how this actually works. So I'm going to go log in. You can make a free account on Quadratic. I'm going to open Quadratic and I'm going to create a new file. So let's go on this new file. We will create some data. So I will upload a file and we will upload this Shopify data. So essentially, imagine you have a Shopify store in which you're selling clothes. So this is all of the sales data of your Shopify website. Now, let me tell you, these are fake emails and fake names, but just to give you a representation of how Quadratic can help you. This is what we have, a data set of 50 orders that people have done with their date, their name, their email, what they've bought, the category, the quantity, the price, the total price and the city that they are from. So this is what my database essentially looks like. Now on the left hand side, you have sheet chat, which is a way for you to interact with data, interact with the sheet by writing plain English. And we are basically going to say something like, show me sales insights by city. So let's say that is what I want to know. I want to know that for every city, how much sale are we generating? So by just saying that it's going to write Python code on its own and it is going to give me the data for the city, the number of orders, the total revenue and the total units sold for every city right here. And it's going to create this amazing bar graph for me to get a visual understanding of the question that I've asked. Now I can ask it pretty much anything. I can ask it to tell me what are the buying trends in let's just say Bengaluru and it's going to go and look at all the people who've bought stuff from Bengaluru and it will create a graph and a table for me to have a look at. So I have loafers, shirt, t-shirt and this is what the buying pattern looks like in Bengaluru. Now I want to say what price points work the best in let's say Mumbai. So let's say I am selling my services or my clothes in Mumbai and I want to see what is the right price point to be selling at. It will create that visualization for me right here. It has some errors, but it will fix it itself. It will write some Python code. And as you can see, it will also make a visualization. And I will know that for price range of 51 to 75, I have the highest sales. So the next time I have to launch something in Mumbai, I will launch it in this particular bracket to get maximum sales. It's super useful. You can do amazing things with it. You can also just search, show me my margins per category, and it will assume some you know, cost of creating particular products and it will create the margin graph for me right here. I can ask it to tell me the best selling products and it will search for it and it will give me the top selling products within each category. So I know that pants are selling really well. I know that loafers are selling really well. I know that sneakers are also selling really well. So I can also ask it, show me what products are sold the most in every city and that's just one way to use it now on the extreme left you will see that we have more options one is called as the code editor now i can go here and i can ask it to do anything practically so i can ask it show me the trends for popular items sold in 
Delhi and it will start writing the code for just that. So I can literally go into the code. I can see how they are writing every code and it's going to make all the changes in real time for me to see and accept. And it is able to create this graph for me to have a look at the item sold in Delhi. Now I imported all of this data using a .csv file, but you can also basically just go on to Quadratic and you can make a connection with your database and then retrieve data from that schema from those tables and start querying it and start getting insights from it. So you just have to go to connections and you can then basically connect any of your databases right here. So I can just go to Postgres and I can enter the name, the host name, and then connect my database with Quadratic. For example, I have this one connected right here. And with this, I can basically access any of the data that I want from my database itself. I love how Quadratic makes it super easy for me to get insights without having to query and write the code myself. Now that was just one example. I can also invite my teammates and get them together to collaborate and get insights together. I can also go to the examples tab and I can start looking at what all is possible with Quadratic. So anything from sentiment analysis to understanding machine learning to random college generator, airport distance calculator, business expense tracking template, crypto spreadsheet tracker, random choice generator, public health data exploration, any data that you have, it can help you plot graphs, it can help you get insights, it can help you do all of that, write SQL queries without writing it yourself by just asking it to do everything in English. And the examples just never end. If you are someone who's looking after a product launch, if you are someone who's interacting with a lot of data, maybe you're a data analyst, maybe you want to gather insights as a businessman, then Quadratic is your way to go. And you can also upgrade to Quadratic Pro if you want to get access to unlimited database connections and you want a lot more AI messages in the sheet chart that I had just shown you. But practically there's so much that you can do with Quadratic if you are someone who's interacting with a lot of data, writing formulas, writing queries, or if you're just a businessman wanting to know how can I increase my sales or what trends can you actually predict in the future, then this is an epic tool that you have to check out. Quadratic is the way to go to interact with data with natural language. Thank you so much for watching till the very end. The link to Quadratic will be in the description. Go have a look and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.